Hello there again, it's Andrew Pickin from Fun Me Fit Productions in the Fun Me Fit Van again, and I'm welcome, absolutely really pleased to introduce Mark Felix, 11 times world's strongest man attendee, a legend in the sport, and we're very popular with the crowd as well, so welcome, Mark. Right, thank you. Some big hands there. So today, today you're the referee. I'll just have to ask you to speak up a little bit, like I am, because we have got a little bit of a dodgy microphone today, um, so it's just picking it up. Um, obviously, you're here to, to referee Yorkshire's strongest man 2015. Can I just ask, with these sort of uh, events uh, that we've got lined up today, have you got a particular favourite event of yours? Yes, um, one of my favourite events, usually the deadlift, you know, for reps is just one, one of my best events. Something that I always do not win like 99% of the time, so it's one of my favourite events. So, I mean, you've got to take a lot of um, uh, determination to really get it up because you have to use your legs a lot, drive your hip through in order for you to get loads of reps. So if you want to win it, you have to really go for it. So you generate the power from, from your lower body as well? Lower you, body. Quite yeah. explosive. You gotta be I'm explosive, assuming, yeah. yeah. Make sure yeah. that you use that leg. Like, yeah. And yeah. don't get soft at any time. So right. when you come down with it, just sit nice and tight and just you start with your legs right through your hip and it's, you're gonna get some good yeah. reps. And obviously we have got a few of those events here today as well. I've, I've, as a referee, are you quite strict, would, would you say? Is it obviously you expect the guys to take to take heed of the rules? Are you going to be quite forceful in, in that as well to make sure that it's all well, fair? Well, I just want to be fair. Yeah. You know, I don't want to say give guys dodgy lift mm -hmm. and then give guys strict lift. I just want to be fair to everyone. Mm -hmm. You know, make sure that it's, it's good, right? So no complaint at the end of the events. Mm -hmm. And obviously I was speaking to Les Wiltshire, who's the MC on the day as well, and, and he's got some support off USN as a sponsor. Are there any sponsors that, that sort of help you? Because I know the sport's developing and it's very important to get corporate partners involved. Well, at the moment, I don't have um, any sponsors mm -hmm. um, as such, but in the past, I used to have like metrics for the past mm -hmm. seven years. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm not with them anymore. So, mm -hmm. you know, there's stuff in the pipeline. So, yeah. you know, just so Big shout out there to any companies that want to get involved. We, all, we always have to say that. And what do you think to our van as well? Though? This is our motor. We do call it Harold as it is fun me fit, and we use it as, as a mock up studio yeah. and, and certain sports as well. Do you yeah. like it? Yeah, I love it. You know, it's a good van to yeah. just move up and down the country. Bit of a silly question, that, it's, but you know, it's, it's, it's got nice quite a following. Up. This going to pull up anyway and just. Um, <laughs> <laughs> just chill out, have a good time. Chill out, you're nice and relaxed here, because obviously yeah. we know we know we've got an important job, and you know obviously I don't want to take too much of your time, so I know it's, it's about to start, you know, very soon and stuff. So just in terms of world's strongest man 2016, I believe you've qualified for. Yeah. Um, when where does that take place, and are you looking forward to it um, as well? We don't know where it's going to take place yet. We just had to wait and see. Yeah. You know, it's going to be yeah. a few months before before the let us yeah. know where it's going to be. And you think it's your time to shine this year? Well, I think every year I think it's my time to shine. You know, it's all depends on how the body feels. You, you know, of course, of course. I'll be safe. Make sure you train hard and. Yeah. stay away from injury and just just one last question which which might suit a lot of people that, that are into bodybuilding or strength sports you know how important is recovery i mean i'm assuming before 2016 obviously you will be training but also there'll be a recovery period to let your body rest recuperate so you're at your peak on, on the actual day well recovery is, um, is very important you don't want to be going out i mean with all those guys and them down on top form with them um, anything in the back of your head you need to be focused you don't want to be you know, God, I got this nigga that I hope it's all up. You know, you just want to be rest, make sure that there is no injury, you train smart, and you make sure that you eat plenty good food and, you know, and I think you'll be fine. So we heard that there, train smart and eat plenty of good food, and those are the top tips for staying in top shape. And I'd just like to thank you for your time, Mark. We do appreciate that, and good luck at refereeing today's event as well. All right, thank you. Thank you, Mark.